T from getting too many kills, but 10, 10 kills. kills now. Wow. Okay, the one thing that still is like okay is that he has storm finishing in like a second here. If he does a storm drop, he can get just as many kills immediately. That's true. So maybe this is how he kind of equalizes this terrible loss that he just went through. But no, his prism's over here. So you know what that tells me? I feel okay. He, may, he has a third nexus on the way, but like I feel like he has to go attack right now and utilize storm. Well, let's see you if know? he actually does that. Like, uh, get over there, do some storms. Maybe you can, like, soften up the army enough that your depths just wipe. Well, they both got glaives out now. Uh, supply count is 124 to uh, 117. With Myunchik ahead in probe, so that means his army is definitely inferior to yeah. SOS's. SOS definitely has a lot more muscle out here on the map. Yeah, he has the blink upgrade, and he has Templars with Psy Storm. So, like, that is a big, big difference. I would uh, SOS. I don't know if he's aware that he does have the army advantage. He should be aware of that, though. Well, so it, I think even for SOS, it would be hard to know exactly where you're at when you have a game that's this weird and they yeah. both expanded this late. It's a really. You're right. It's such. You know, a, you, you are playing kind of in the dark. Mm. But, uh, right now, Myungshik is actually the one kind of pressuring on the map. He's got this kind of positional advantage having that watchtower, but like. For sure, if they fought right now, uh, SOS has the upper yeah, hand. Yeah, I don't even know if Myunchik's uh, aware of that. He might think he has more. Yeah, he, uh, might. he might not be privy to that information. All right, here we go. That is a big size storm going off, and another couple of really big ones right there. Is this actually going to be enough for him, though? He's attacking in. The angling's pretty good. The Archon still dealing some damage back there. We have a hallucinated Archon here for Myunchik, but it's not able oh. to come up. And it looks like SOS is beginning to roll over Myunchik. Yeah. GG. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. So awesome. SOS going up three to one right now against Myungshik. Good God, SOS is just really, really solid. I think Myungshik should have stayed back. Yeah, I think he read that situation wrong. It's easy for us, you know, we have omnipotence in the game. We can see everything and be everywhere. These two players cannot. Uh, Myungshik got I've, a strong to start. Be, to be fair, I'm pretty sure SOS is omnipotent, but uh, he's a demigod. Yeah. No, but really, like, he shouldn't have been out there. Like, he spent right. a good amount of money to kill probes off. Should have sat back a little bit longer, let that kick in. Uh, that economic advantage that he gained through that DT drop. But, uh, you know, it was it was a really strong play from both sides there. Yeah. Um, Mianchik has to win the next three games. He's basically yeah. not allowed to make any more mistakes. Uh, he has to play perfectly. I don't know if anybody in the world can do that. 3-0 SOS and a PvP? <laughs> no. I don't know. I mean, anything could happen, but that's going to be pretty difficult. Yeah. We are going to go to a short break. When we return, we're going to go on to the next match here in tonight's GSL Code S. You're so bad for me. I am farmer. 농장에서 온 프레스트 주스. 델몬트 파머스 주스 바. She's a girl. Yeah. Every day. Yum 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 yum. 여기요. 대결의 룰을 아십니까? 대결은 환경이 매우 중요하지요. 그래서 아레나의 잔디들은 매우 세심하게 관리되고 있습니다. 물론 쉬운 일은 아니죠. 클래시 로얄, 지금 다운로드 받으세요. 질서와 수호를 위해서는 마귀 화염이 누구도 나를 막을 순 없어 방해하겠다면 전부 부서주지 
나는 KT 기가 인터넷 당신과 끊김없이 게임을 즐기죠 어디서나 우린 함께해요 어때요? 나랑 콜라보 하실래요? 당신의 KT 오 물로 지금 거의 뭐 수분을 그냥 갖다 드리 붓는 것 같아요 자 바른 쪽과 안 바른 쪽입니다 차에 보여드릴게요 내가 발라봤는데 대표는 앞으로 그냥 나도 찍어 발라야 될것 같아요 잘 봐요 자 이렇게 깔끔하게 아래쪽만 다듬어도 선이 딱 살아있잖아요 선 라인 같아요 <웃음> 잠깐만 어 이런 느낌이구나 어허 오늘 여러 가지 제품들 올리브영에서 제가 지금 제품을 받아서 사용을 해봤는데 굉장히 좋은 것 같아요 올리브영 제품이 짱인 것 같습니다 기가 IoT 헬스 올레 TV 켜고 퍼팅하고 바이크 타고 체지방 체크까지 실감나게 재밌다 기가 IoT 헬스 김지원의 KT 할리스타 에브리데이 여기요 대신적인 혁신 이런 실시간 라이브 웅짤 기능은 지금 스노우웹에서 밖에 없죠? 굉장히 많은 팬분들이 영상 메시지와 메신저를 보내주고 계십니다 아프리카 원탑 역캠답게 이설이라고 메시지가 왔는데 길 가다 만나지 마라 길 가다 만나지 마라고 느낌 있죠? 리본 하나 찬 다음에 딸랑딸랑 고양이 섹시합니다 외쳐 스노우 헬라우 네 여러분 안녕하세요 2016년 제주항공 모델 성준입니다 리프레시 제주에요 네 아프리카TV와 함께하는 킹덤스토리 연애의 신 어, 이거 사극을 찍는 것 같아요. 저 정말 안 어울립니다. 아, 약간 외소하고. 위초보 삼국 대결. 장비! 나이스! 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 어, 나 심쿵했어. 17,800. 와! 분주는 무릎을 꿇을 수 있어요. 아, 뭐야, 이거. 저 어떻게 보는 건데? 저에게는 간호 장비 같은 존재입니다. 진짜 유익한 게임이니까 여러분들 진짜로 많이 해보셨으면 좋겠습니다. 모바일 게임을 넘어선 액션 RPG 히트 양 팀이 이제 정해졌는데 그냥 대결을 하면 좀 재미가 없으니까요 아우! 어? 탈락! 어? 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 이선을 향해 쐈어요! 아니 큐피티 아니 큐피티야 뭐가 이 정도라면 4분 때 마무리 되나요? 자 이거 3대2 기회 들어가는데요 유저 전체에게 깃털 천 개를 선물로 드립니다 타이밍이 지금인 것 같습니다 그만한 게임이 지금 모바일 게임에는 없다고 어! 힘찬 행사 손으로 직접 기른 신선한 오렌지의 맛, 파머의 이름을 허락한다. I am farmer. 농장에서 온 프레스트 주스, 델몬트 파머스 주스 바. 
Welcome back to the GSL Code S. SOS is in the lead, but I got to say, Myunchik is hanging on like hell. Yeah. He is doing a really good job. He's putting up sick fights in every single game. That's right. But SOS just seems like he's on another level. Now, Myunchik has to win the next three games. And uh, let me tell you something on this map, are you oh, serious? Yeah. Yeah. Beating SOS on New Gettysburg? Well, the thing nobody is, wants to play SOS on this map. If he can beat him on New Gettysburg, he absolutely can win the series, though, because Frozen well Temple, said. I feel like that's even a good map for Myungshik in his type of style. Like, you can just bulldoze nerds who expand there. So, like, this is going to be the ultimate test because New Gettysburg is a map that seems like it was invented for SOS. He did lose one game to stats there, which was, like, kind of weird, like carriers and stuff, but, like, this is SOS's type of map. It's so tricky. There's going to be a lot of mind games. It's hard to actually kill each other. Uh, yeah, so this is, I don't know. I, Dude, let's go to game seven, have SOS win in a nail biter, and like my life is complete. Let's you can throw me into a volcano after that, taste, because <laughs> I already know he'll win BlizzCon at that point. I mean, to be honest, this is a map where you could definitely cheese on. I mean, Myunchik, it's not like this map is bad for Myunchik at all. Myunchik could do some really weird stuff here. Uh, the question is, can SOS, you know, bend it off? Yeah. We've already learned that SOS is not untouchable. Myunchik won in one of the craziest PvPs we've ever casted. Yeah. This night is just madness PvPs. Some of the best I've ever seen from both sides. I knew that tonight should be good. It was probably going to be, you know, really exciting. Yeah. Some I didn't know it was going to be this good. Anyways, let's get ready. This is game number five. SOS versus Myunchik. Over here in the blue, in the lead in this series. Jin Air Green Wings, SOS. Two-time world champion. That's right. Looking to make it three. And in the red, he needs to turn this series SD around. Telecom T1, Young Shin. Do we have any probes sent out on the map here? Nope. Nope. No, nothing sent out just yet. No. Okay. So, I mean, cause, you know, to be honest, this is definitely a map where you could have done that, and these two guys do do weird strats they like that. They do. So. Well, everything is on the line for Myungshik. Does SOS play a safe game? Does he do something crazy? It's really kind of hard to say, but there's a lot of pressure on Myungshik right now. Thanks for coming down, guys. Welcome to the studio. We love you guys. All the way from Switzerland. It's pretty far. It's a long trip. Is Does Switzerland make good cheese? Uh, they make good chocolate. But not good cheese. I'm sure they're oh, they make Swiss cheese if you like Swiss cheese. Well, there's too many holes in that cheese. Man, it's it's incomplete. It's <laughs> they have holes in the cheese. What's the deal with that? Now I uh We got you gotta make that pilgrimage to Nerd Mecca, the GSL studio. Yeah, that is it. Alright, get ready. The probe chest bump. Uh! <laughs> <laughs> that's what it looks like when Tase and I meet at the GSL studio every right. day. <laughs> get off the train. We Run into each other like that. Uh, well, I mean, so far this game looks pretty normal. Um, whenever we cast a, a game on this map, it's really important to highlight one of the, the core features of it is that there's this long bridge, it's very narrow, mm. that connects um, the left side of the map to the right side of the map. But uh, it's so narrow, it, it's kind of hard to get out of the bridge. Yeah. But occasionally you'll see units rushed through there. Uh, if they're not going to use that bridge, and they're going to rotate around the top. Mm -hmm. Uh, SOS already being tricky, by the way. He's he went he started a zealot and a soccer, and then as soon as the probe left, he canceled the zealot, threw down a twilight. So oh, good call. Yeah, just kind of like skimping on early units to try to get his tech out a little bit faster. What will this be for? I would imagine he wants to go DT drop or something like that. Mothership cores going to uh, go ahead and try to scout and poke into each other. Pretty, uh, pretty standard. You always have to make a stalker on this map as well to block that mothership core from coming in. Yeah, you want to try to drive that away. Yeah, Nexus on the way uh, for for Myungshik, whereas it is that Dark Templar shrine. And kind of an interesting reversal here. SOS is going to try to do uh, a pretty uh, risky tech mm -hmm. here. And you know, one of the reasons why he's doing this is because he can. Yeah, he he's in the lead. Can. I mean, this is you know, this, it could just kill him. And like DT is not really. 
super risk in this matchup. It's, like, it's just it's, it's good tech. In. It's good tech to have. It's, I'd say it's one of the rarer techs. Out of yeah. all the tech. I mean, like it's not like Robo where we're like, oh yeah. Like getting sure. it this early does set you a little bit behind if it doesn't do anything. But like it's it's just like such a useful building overall. Like having DTs around because of the state of detection for Protoss and how you can one shot shot probes and stuff. It's just it's good stuff. So uh, Myungshik is making a Robo and he already has a Stargate about to finish. So if he makes an Oracle right away, this could line up really decently at defending this. Um, let's see if the DTs can come in here and uh, do any damage. He actually makes a Phoenix. Okay. So, not, not okay, a great a, sign. He does have a Sentry, though. That's going to buy him a little bit of time. The thing is, the DT should do okay damage at least. Yeah. Wow, like, look at that. He just doesn't see that. Yeah. <laughs> it's just so well placed. Okay. So, can um, we see him do a Cannon Rush? Like yeah, this, or that's was that right. Shik? I can't quite uh, remember. Anyways, I'm not somebody. sure. I'm, I'm going to get him mixed up now, too. Um, okay, he just walked by him. We don't see any force field. Uh oh. Oh, oh and he, I just saw Myungshik's face. I just. Yeah, he this just is, jerked his head when this he realized. Is not good. Three probes already dead. The lost mining time is crazy, too. Oh, okay, well. Oh, man. Jeez. Oh, no. The observer is coming, but I mean, how much more damage is going to be dealt here? Sneaky moves going on right now. Okay, well, you. Like, traps one of the DTs, I guess, so he gets a kill there, but 10 probes going down. He's even buying more time. Look, he's just going to run this around for as long as possible. Yeah. <laughs> uh, gets a pick up there. Now, he'll stabilize here. The game isn't 100% over, but right now he's down nine probes. Nine. And, the, like, already we have, like, counter tech to Phoenixes in the form of Blink almost being done for SOS. Yeah. Well, this is going to segue quite nicely Ooh. for him, I think. Yeah. Like, it, Myungshik needs to do something miraculous here. Right. It's it's a very tall order for him to get something done. Uh, I don't think that, like, SOS can just walk over and kill him. But, you know, he can he can start putting on the heavy pressure. He can take another base. Like, SOS has a lot of options right now, whereas Myungshik really does not. So the probe count right now, guys, it's 41 for SOS and 32 for Myungshik, um, which is a pretty big difference, especially when you consider that uh, SOS only lost one Dark Templar. Mm -hmm. I mean, he actually still has this DT out on the map. This DT yeah. could still do a, a tremendous amount of damage later on. Yeah, he's going to go drop it in the main base, it looks like. Yeah. And he's going to hit the front with the Blink Stalkers as well. Okay, the Phoenixes oh. know this is coming, though. This is a great catch by Myungshik. Definitely very, very important. Uh, the DT, though, he's got to deal with that somehow. Oh, look at this. He's going to abuse him over here with these Stalkers with Blink. And the oh, DT no. is doing more damage. Yeah, Five kills already. The Stalkers oh, have backed up. Oh, my God. Up. I don't even much. think Myungshik knows. Yeah, he Look doesn't even realize what's going on. This oh is crazy. Oh, my God. I wonder if we get a shot of his face right when he realizes it. This is just He doesn't like, know. He no, actually just doesn't probe. see this. Okay, now he's going to realize in a second here. Oh, oh yeah. There it is. Man. Wow. <laughs> SOS goes to the GSL CODES Finals. Big thumbs up right there. Well deserved. He is not a GSL champion yet, Tasteless. Well, but maybe soon. Yeah, maybe soon, man. SOS has done it. Uh, five very different games. Recommend this series to anybody. Oh my god, this was so crazy tonight. SOS is on fire. This is the last tournament that gives a spot into BlizzCon. He didn't qualify for the SSL. He hasn't done well this year. But he's picking it up now. This is so crazy, the run he's making. I mean, how long have we been casting his games? And, you know, we've, well, I mean, we've been saying it for a while, like he'll eventually be in a, in a code S final. Yeah. By the way, props to Myungshik. I mean, he really has developed into an incredible player. But, I mean, you're against SOS, the two-time world champion. Yeah. What are you going to do? <laughs> you're going to get Shrek is what you're yeah. going to do. Oh, man. I mean, bopping him in that last game. Damn. All right, well, guys, we got our first... Uh, player in the finals, and what a great player to have. I mean, nobody can argue that this guy doesn't deserve to be here. Absolutely. Uh, I can't wait for this final stasis, whether it be Bion or whether it be Deer. Oh, yeah, I don't even care. Well, if it's Deer, we're going to have an early night, perhaps. <laughs> like, this guy's Possibly. BVP. 3-0 into CJ Hero. 4-1 into Myungshik, who got to study him playing CJ Hero. Yeah. What else do you want? Like. His PvP is immaculate. Actually, Myungshik's PvP might be better than Deer's, too, to be honest. Yeah. He looked like really good. Yeah, he looked better than Hero, for sure. You're right about that. And he took a game to prove it. Uh, we're going to go to an interview here with our champion tonight, SOS, your winner uh, out of this best of seven. And look, this was actually a pretty close series. I mean, the last one was a little bit slower, but 
the last game, I should say. But I mean, this was very back and forth in a lot of these games. And SOS, he just, any situation, he knows. He's the MacGyver Protoss. <laughs> 이번 시즌 첫 번째 결승 진출자 진혜영 그림입니다. Our first finalist of the season is SOS. Congratulations. Thank you. 와 결승 갑니다. 국내 정규리그 기준으로 처음이에요. 소감 어떠세요? 우선 It's your first finals in a regular Korean league. 기대 안 했었는데 한 단계 한 단계 올라가다 보니까. I didn't actually have high hopes for the season, but after I got to the round of 16, I decided to change my goal and just make it to the finals no matter what. Now I'm going to have to prepare very hard for my final opponent. You must be really satisfied with your performance tonight. I really prepared hard for today's match. The style of uh, my play and Yunchuk's play is actually pretty similar. So a lot of the strategies that I wanted to use, in the, um, I wasn't able to pull off here. I had to adjust a lot, but I was able to pull my victory off tonight. 사실 예측하기 어려운 선수인데 과연 뭘 할까 이런 생각을 굉장히 많이 했었거든요. 아무키스를 선택한 배경이 있어요. 우선 제가 그 맵에서 So why did you opt for Dark Templars in the last game? 원래 뒤에서 소환하는 게 On that map I played a lot of matches. 그걸 바탕으로 유리하게 풀어갈 수 있겠다 싶어서 I noticed it's pretty handy on that map specifically. I win a lot of my games in practice with the DT strat on that map. So that's why I decided to pull it out then. 너무 아쉬울 것 같아요. 네. 제가 제 나름대로 머리 머리 굴려가지고 진짜 불사조도 하고 분열기까지 찍었었는데 제가 실수로 분광기를 I went for the phoenixes and the disruptors. 못 살려서 팬이 됐던 것 같아요. My micro was not the best. So that's kind of how I lost that one game against Miochik. 그런데 이후에 오히려 4세트에서 저는 더 깜짝 놀랐는데 그 프로스트에서 아무래도 몰래 멀티나 건물이 많다 보니까 그때 정찰을 꽁 so on the map frost, you scouted very carefully. Do you normally do that, or was that a nod towards Nyanshik's play style? I know most of the locations where Nyanshik likes to hide his structures on that map. So I was actually scouting specific locations that I had seen him hide stuff before. He also says he hides his buildings in probably the same spots that Myeonchik hides them, so he was able to predict where a lot of the structures would be at. So, it's your first finals in a regular league such as Code S. How do you feel about that? I played in BlizzCon and I won in BlizzCon. I know what it's like to play in front of a large audience. Well, since it's in Korea, I'm going to be able to bring my friends and family down, so that's pretty exciting for me. Your coach said you play better in this uh, season of the year. Can you tell us about that? I hadn't really thought about that, but... But since I'm doing very well again in the second half of the year, maybe that's true. But to tell you the truth, I'm not that concerned about the weather. Your opponent will either be Deer or Byun. Deer defeated you last season. And Byun defeated you this season. And sent you to the losers match. In the round of eight semifinals, I faced uh, Protoss players, so I've mostly been grinding on their matches. To be honest, I prefer to play here since I've already had so much practice in PvP. Anything you want to say before we close this out, SOS? <laughs> I hope you guys play hard in the semifinals and show some great games on Friday. And I'm looking forward to playing against either Beyond or Deer. Any final comments to your fans? 
많이 응원해 주시면 So it's just the finals is left now. Hope you guys keep supporting me and cheering for me. I'm going to try my best to win the first GSL in my whole life. 많이 구경해 주세요. 감사합니다. So please come down to the venue and cheer for me. 감동하셨군요. 네, 김유진 선수 계속해서 결승전에서도 멋진 활약 기대해 보겠습니다. 다시 한번 결승 진출 축하드립니다. 감사합니다. All right, saying the final congratulations. And that is going to do it for tonight. Our Mentosis, dude, he really turns it on under the pressure. It's pretty crazy. Yeah, he's just really good. I mean, he might be. He wins. We got to put him in that same level as like we put MVP in. You know, you're right. Like, I mean, MVP was the most dominant player, but SOS is just. If you look at the results, it's hard. Hard to find somebody that comes close. Yeah, he's, you know, he's, you know who he's kind of reminding me of from Brood War would be like a Jalizer, where his dominance is spread out so much that you're like, oh, you're just never going away ever. Like, yeah, you'll a lot of players, be one of the best players. Yeah, a lot of players have like a few years in a row where they're just godly. Like, yeah, it's, basic, but like it's, it's truly rare indeed to get a player that has like, okay, he won a world championship, didn't get to the next one, won the world championship after that. And now he's making a quick run at getting back to BlizzCon in the final seconds of the Korean leagues. Like, crazy stuff. And, I mean, if he wins this GSL, and especially BlizzCon, that's like, you cannot say MVP's name without mentioning SOS at that point, I think. That's right. Um, so, uh, we will be back on uh, Friday, actually. Yes, yes. Uh, so, uh, not tomorrow, but the day after. Same time, same place. It's going to be Beyond versus Deer. Very interesting story here. Deer's already won a GSL code S. And then for a while, he kind of faded out. But now he's clearly back, clearly a serious threat. And Beyond has been with us since the very, very beginning of uh, the GSL. Yeah. And now he's, he's very close to actually becoming a champion. So this is going to be really cool. I'm not even sure who's going to win this one. Yeah, that's a really hard one to predict. Deer stepped up so hard against TY. It was amazingly, amazingly played. Yeah. But Byun gets to study that too, let's not forget. So Byun definitely gets some uh, some good preparation going in. He knows what type of styles that Deer is ready and willing to use. And I don't know, that's a really hard one to predict. It's going to be really good. I don't, I don't even mind. Um, if either player can move on. I'm fine with that. Yeah. Uh, and of course, SOS in the finals. This could make history. Yeah. This, this. We've been casting SOS for so long, but you know, normally when we're saying GG and he's, you know, holding the trophy, we're not in Korea. Yeah. Uh, now, you know, in the oldest StarCraft II um, tournament, uh, you know, in English. Uh, in fact, the oldest esports show that's been regular in English. This show, uh, he might actually win. Yeah. It, it, this is real. It's coming, and I think he is a favorite against both those guys. That's right. Like, I really do. Um, don't forget, guys, come down to our finals. It's going to be incredible. Get there early. Last time it filled up immediately, and a lot of people weren't able to watch live. We want you to not have that kind of experience. Yeah, it is going to be so much fun. You watch his games tonight, and you'll be able to watch them there as well. Don't forget Friday, of course. Bjorn against Deer should be an insane series, a really hard one to predict. That's going to do it for us. Guys, thank you so much for joining us. From everybody from Africa TV, we love you. We'll see you Friday. Have a good morning, afternoon, or night, wherever you are. Get yourselves together. Hands up, hands up.